Iris, like you always say, can't keep our guard down. Thank you. Uh, Pinal County Sheriff Paul Babu, he has announced that he is running for Congress. This will be the sheriff's second time running after a failed bid back in 2012. ABC 15's Allison Rodriguez spoke with him one on one. She's joining us live. So, Allison, yeah. the question so many people ask you this morning is why is he doing this again? Yeah, that's a good question, Nick and Danielle. And he told me he had every intention of running for re election as Pinal County Sheriff. But then a surprise announcement left the seat for Congressional District 1 up for grabs. Sheriff Paul Babu making a surprise announcement Monday morning. I'm actually running for Congress. The Pinal County Sheriff will run for the seat left open by U.S. Representative Ann Kirkpatrick. She recently announced she's running for a U.S. Senate seat against John McCain. I intend to win not just the Republican nomination, but the, the seat in Congress. He already has competition. Hours after his announcement, Arizona State House Speaker David Gowan announcing his run. In a statement, Gowan says, We've got a good field of nice candidates who will claim they are the greatest conservatives of all time. The biggest difference between us all is that with me, the voters know they can rely on my campaign promises to be kept. Babu is no stranger to this race. He made a bid for Congress back in 2012 in District 4 before dropping out amid attacks on his personal life. And he says he's grown through that experience. I had to survive through that. Uh, to be overwhelmingly reelected, uh, the voters of my county passed judgment on me, and they decided that uh, not only that I'm a good sheriff, that a lot of these issues, which were largely personal, really don't matter. One is the largest district in the state. I do want to run down quickly uh, the other candidates. There are three others, and that is rancher Gary Keene and former Secretary of State Ken Bennett, both Republicans, and the sole Democrat Tom O'Halloran, guys.